Elkinor Ricks, ridden by Mark Richards. Two is Bound and Duty, Mark Perrett. Three, Deep Sensation, Declan Murphy. Four, Flashy Buck for Ireland, ridden by Tom Taff. Five, Fragrant Dawn, Graham Bradley. Six, Space Fair, Adrian McGuire. Seven, Tin Ryland, Peter Scudamore. Eight, Val Rodian, Ian Lawrence. Nine, Young Pokey, Jamie Osborn. Ten, Mass Appeal for Ireland, ridden by Charlie Swan. And 11, the other mayor, like Mass Appeal, Shamana, written by Richard Dunwoody, and here's how they bet. And pretty close value between three of them. Deep Sensation has the edge. It's three to one, the favorite. And uh, Tin Ryland and Young Pokey are on four to one. Then uh, quite a gap to Mass Appeal, 10 to one. Alconor Rex, Space Fair, and Shamana, all on tens. 40 to one as well, Rodian, that's gone out two points. Fragrant Dawn is 16 to 1, Flashy Buck 20s, and on 50 to 1, the outsider bound in duty. Yes, the right, wonderful class of the first sponsors of the Arkle, and that's it, and they're away in it. It's Space Fair, the early leader in the centre, bandaged and easy to distinguish. They come to the first, Young Pokey right up there with them, Flashy Buck jumped at last, they're all safely over it. Space Fair, Young Pokey, Bound and Duty over on the far side, Fragrant Dawn towards the near side, those four being followed by Shamana, Young Pokey disputes it now with Space Fair and Fragrant Dawn, Fragrant Dawn towards the left of the picture, just taking it up now from Space Fair and Young Pokey and Bound and Duty and Shamana, then comes Mass Appeal, Deep Sensation and Val Rodian. Behind them, Tin Ryland and Alkinor Rex and Flashy Buck as Fragrant Dawn lands over the third in the lead and they're going a right good gallop. Flashy Buck was a little bit deliberate and slow at that one. Young Pokey's in second and Space Fair third and Bound of Duty four, five, Shimano six, Val Rodian on the inside of Mass Appeal with Deep Sensation next and then Tin Ryland. Little gap to Flashy Buck and a further gap to Alkinor Rex as the leaders and the whole field cross the fourth with the exception of Alkinor Rex who was very slow at that one has got himself tailed off and is being pulled up in fact so as they run down the 10 left in this Waterford Castle Arkle they're being led at the fifth by Fragrant Dawn Young Pokey on the outside Space Fair then on the inner bound and duty with Shamana close and then Val Rodian Deep sensation making ground towards the outer as they come towards the water. Fragrant Dawn lands in the lead from Young Pokey. Space Fair on the outside, Band and Duty on the inner, Shamana. Then comes Val Rodian. Then on the outside, making a little bit of ground, is Deep Sensation as they jump the first of the ditches. Mass Appeal made a mistake there, and Flashy Buck has gone. Flashy Buck a faller with that one, the horse all right. His rider beginning to sit up now over the eighth. Young Pokey moved up on the outside of Fragrant Dawn there. Space King on the outside of Shamana, Space Fair, I should say. Then on the inside is Abandoned Duty as they race towards the final ditch four from home. Fragrant Dawn, the leader from Young Pokey, a little between those two. Space Fair, then comes Shamana, who's making quite good ground. Deep Sensation still going well towards the outside, but as they begin the run downhill, three left to jump, it's still Fragrant Dawn, the leader. Fragrant Dawn from Young Pokey. Under pressure towards the left of the picture, Deep Sensation getting a reminder. Bound and Duty is not far off the lead towards the right of the picture. Space Fair is still there too, coming down towards the next now. Three from home. Fragrant Dawn lands in the lead from Young Pokey. Space Fair, deep sensation on the outside. Shaman has got a chance though as they come down towards the second last. Fragrant Dawn now, Young Pokey. On the inside, Shamana, Space Fair, Shamana a faller at that one, rounding the home turn now in the Waterford Castle Arkle, and they've got one fence left to jump now, and it's Young Pokey who's gone to the front from Space Fair, Fragrant Dawn and Deep Sensation trying to reduce a run towards the stand side, but Young Pokey has the advantage, Tin Ryland's making ground, Young Pokey lands in the lead, 
from Tin Ryland who's moved into second then on the far side Space Fair Young Pokey the leader as they race up towards the line it's Young Pokey and Jamie Osborne bidding for a double and he's going to achieve it as they come to the line Young Pokey has won the water for Castle Arkell second Tin Ryland and third Space Fair and four was Deep Sensation five and six Fragrant Dawn and Bound in Duty and behind them Mass Appeal and Val Rodian they're the only finishers and so the result of the 1992 Waterford Castle Arkell Challenge Trophy is first, number nine, Young Pokey, owned by Mr. M. L. Oberstein, trained by Oliver Sherwood, and written by Jamie Osborne, a double for him. Second, number seven, Tin Ryland, owned by Mr. Michael Buckley, trained by Nicky Henderson, and written by Peter Scudamore. And third, number six, Space Fair, owned by Osborne House Limited, trained by Richard Lee, and written by Adrian McGuire. Uh, fourth was number three, Deep Sensation. First, number nine, Young Pokey, four to one. Second, number seven, Tin Ryland, five to one. And third, number six, Space Fair, 11 to one.